Capricorns. Welcome to Anti Tarot. Today we're going to do your love reading for November 2018. I just want to say thank you for all your likes, share, and subscription last month to help me grow my channel. And this month I'm going to incorporate a few more um, decks. So if you're interested in any of the decks, I'm going to post it the links in the description below and if you're interested in booking a private session um, the information will be in the description below as well spirit please give me a message for capricorn in love for november 2018 capricorn in love for november 2018 spirit angels guys please give me a message for capricorns in love for November 2018 Capricorn in love for November 2018 the lovers card so there is love in the air and it's funny because when I was still talking doing the introduction a um, I believe it was the Ten of Cups that fell out. It was a, another love card that fell out, but I put it back because I hadn't started, officially started your reading yet. So, looks like love is in the air, and the angel is shooting that arrow in. Cupid. Spirit, what other messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018. Capricorns in love for November 2018. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn in love for November Knight of Pentacles. So it could be with another Earth sign, another Capricorn, or Taurus, or Virgo. Or it could just be this is also money. He's offering money. Money could be coming in as well. So far, so good. Love and money. Spirit, what other messages do you have for Capricorn? Yep. This was the card that flipped over while I was doing the introduction and I put it back because I had not officially started your reading yet Capricorns and now it's coming back out so it's meant to be Ten of Cups so it looks like the relationship if you've been in a relationship is moving on to the next phase if you're not in a relationship a relationship could be starting Okay, so if, if you haven't been in a relationship, a relationship could be starting. If you have been in a relationship for a while, it could be moving to the next phase. Next step. Commitment. Okay, so now I forgot which one came out. So these two were down, but I'm not sure which came out with what because this came out two cards came out with this so one is traveling so you may be traveling and this is a legal situation so I'm going to put it back because I don't remember and we'll see what else comes out spirit what other messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018 Capricorns in love for November 2018 Spirit, what other messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018. The Emperor. So he's weighing, he's weighing the pros and cons of the situation, con contemplating. Or getting ready to make a decision to get more serious. This one pop up, Seven of Pentacles. So you're in a, a, a place where you'll be able to help or maybe do some charity or help out, help the homeless or do, do something. I feel like some kind of charity work for the holidays or help out or help the less fortunate. 
or maybe you'll be asked to do it. Savings, putting funds away, saving, saving for the, the long term. Savings. This is also behind. This is the this is plowing the field and the farm. Saving. Putting food away for the winter. Spirit, what other messages do you have for Capricorn in love? Stepping back, looking at the big picture. So someone is really make looking to make a decision, weighing the pros and cons. Stepping back, looking at the whole big picture as a whole. So maybe some serious decision making or contemplating here. Spirit, what other messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018. Capricorns in love. Let me just. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn in love for November 2018? Capricorns in love for November 2018, Spirit. What messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Celebration, bugle horn blowing, coins in the air. So some kind of celebration, get together, happy times. A little mental stress. So maybe you've been working so hard, but someone is having mental stress. Almost, almost to the, like a nervous breakdown kind of stress. Building. So I don't know if, you are building Capricorns or the other person you're you're asking about or thinking of building but there's a lot of planning looking at the big picture weighing building in this reading what other messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018 spirit mental conflict so someone is having some mental so I don't this is um like a mixed reading so I don't know if you have two separate situations going on in your life Capricorns or if this is for two sets of Capricorns because on the one hand there's love and money and um, relationship moving to the next step but then on the other hand there's a lot of you know like weighing the pros and cons, looking at the big picture, saving, saving for a rainy day, and then there's also celebration, but then yet there's also mental stress, mental conflict. So I don't know if the, this is two different aspects or two different parts of your life, Capricorns, or if it's for two different sets of Capricorns. Like one, you know, some of you Capricorns are happy, in love, getting ready to become more serious in your relationship and then the other Capricorns are going through some kind of mental stress or maybe maybe it applies to both you know maybe your love life is going well but there's other stress in your life so I don't know but there's like two different messages here there's like mental stress and then there's happiness and love spirit what other messages do you have for Capricorn in love for November 2018. Capricorns. 
Okay, so Nine of Cups. This is normally a, a wish card in the traditional tarot, but in this card, um, it's my, I see it as a virtue card. So it's remind, reminding you, Capricorns, of all the virtues in life. So if you have to make the decision, you know, keep that in mind. Integrity, balance, karma, scale of balance, strength, love, chastity. So keep those virtues in mind if you're weighing pros and cons and making decisions. Let's see what the other person, how the other person are feeling about you. Spirit, what is the other person feeling about Capricorn? What is the other person? Proud. So the other person's feeling proud. I don't know if they're feeling proud of you, Capricorns, or they're just feeling proud of an accomplishment they just achieved. And underneath that is honored, satisfied, please. So either they have achieved something or they are proud of you of having achieved something. Let's see. How are you feeling, Capricorns? How are Capricorns feeling? What is Capricorns feeling? What is Capricorns feeling towards the person's spirit? What is... Interesting. Trapped. Imprisoned. Corner. Stuck. So Capricorns, this is saying that you feel trapped. So I don't know if this is mental. Is a mental entrapment. Or if, if you're really like trapped in a situation or just feeling trapped. And underneath that was vulnerable. Defenseless, unprotected, helpless. And there, there was another one underneath. Receptive, open, accepting, welcoming. So I only meant to pull one card, but those two vulnerable, receptive came out. So I don't know if it has any additional meanings for you guys. Um, let's see what the other person wants to say to you. Spirit, what does the other person want Capricorn to know? What does the other person want Capricorns to know? What does the other person... I treasure you. I treasure you. So they seem to have very positive feelings towards you, Capricorn, because they're feeling proud and they feel like they're tr they treasure you. What does Capricorn wants to say to the other person, Spirit? Spirit, what does Capricorns want to say to the other person? What does Capricorns want to say to the other person, Spirit? Spirit, what does Capricorns want to say to the other person? What does Capricorns want to say to the other person? Spirit, what does Capricorns want to say to the other person? This just fell out because it doesn't make sense. What does Capricorn wants to say to the other person? Spirit, what does Capricorn wants to say to the other person? I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna do this. Spirit, what does Capricorns want to say to the other person? What does Capricorns want to say to the other person? Spirit, what does Capricorn wants to say to the other person? What does Capricorn wants to say? Talk to me like I'm someone you love. So there's some kind of a contradiction to this reading. So it seems like the other person really treasure you and love you and is proud of you. But for some reason, Capricorn, the reading is showing that you're feeling trapped and you want the other person to talk to you like there's someone you love. And then you're on, underneath is also feeling vulnerable. So I don't know if you're having conflicting thoughts about this relationship or maybe they're happy about the relationship you're not or I don't know what's going on but there's like conflicting messages here let's see what chakras what chakras or healing energy centers 
needs to be worked on to clear the energy. Spirit, what chakras does the other person that Capricorn is dealing with needs to work on? What chakras or energy centers does the other person that Capricorn is dealing with needs to work on? Spirit, what chakras does the other person that Capricorns is dealing with needs to work on? What chakras? Grounding. So they need to ground. They need to work on their earth, earth star chakra. And what cap what what chakras does Capricorns need to work on, Spirit? What chakras? Inner strength. So inner strength, Capricorn. You need to work on inner inner strength, which is the solar plexus chakra. And then there's another card underneath, Mother Earth. So that that could be grounding as well. So this came out. It, they they both jumped out. Let's see what do, what action do you need to take? What action needs to be taken, Spirit? What does what action does the other person that Capricorn is dealing with needs to take? What actions does the other person that Capricorn is dealing with needs to take? What action does the other person that Capricorn is dealing with needs to take? Surrender your ego. Cultivate gratitude, be of service to others, and come from your heart. A big ego can work against you, but humility will further your goals. So they're saying for the other person to let go of their ego. So I don't know if whoever you're dealing with has a big ego, Capricorns, but that's what they need to let go of. And underneath there it says surrender to the magic of who you are. We all have magic in us, even in the mundane aspect of life. Remember that you are a magical being with a uniqueness and worth that come from just being you. Let's see. That just came out, but I thought I'll read it. Let me just read. Let me shuffle specifically for you. Spirit, what actions does Capricorns need to take? What action does Capricorns need to take, Spirit? What actions? Surrender to play. Take a break from overthinking a goal. Do something fun. Play is a time of recreation and ju ju juvenation. So spirit, your angel, your guys are telling you just take a break and play. Because um, apparently you've been overthinking about a goal. So I guess all this thinking and planning and mental stress and men mental conflict is causing stress so they're saying to take a break play Capricorns have some fun and let's see what your angels what messages does the angels have for you spirit angels there was a car that's angels what messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018 Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorns in love for November 2018? Spirit, what messages? This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. So this confirms this lover's card and this ten of cups card. But then the other messages in this reading is a little contradictory as far as stress and things like that. So Capricorn, I don't know if you're just stressed or worry about the future and just planning or if that's a totally diff different situation in your life, different part of your life, or if that's for a whole total different set of Capricorns. So this is a general reading, not specific to anyone. So apparently I'm picking up a couple of different energies so um, I hope it resonates with some of you Capricorns out there let me know in the comments if it did um, and thanks for watching and I will see you next month Capricorns take care bye